I'm Larry Oberly. I'm president and CEO of SpeedPro. We're a custom, just-in-time manufacturer of high-impact graphics. And so we're a B2B model. We serve customers in a consultative manner. And we're not a retail concept. We are not a sign shop of any imagination. We really work with our B2B clients to find custom solutions for them, whether they need it same day, next day, or in two days. We'll collaborate with our customers to really give them the type of impact that they want to have to help them sell more or to change the culture within their offices. Our business was founded in the United States when we started franchising in 2003 in Texas by our founder, Blair Gran. Um, eventually, he decided to sell his business, and uh, our company is private equity owned, just like a number of franchise businesses. I've been with the company since November of 2017, and we have built the company now to have 133 locations in the United States. We also have a sister company called SpeedPro Canada that has about 45 locations through a different owner um, across the, the country of Canada. Most of our franchisees so far have been ex-executives within corporate America. And whether they were displaced at one point, maybe in the downturn of the depths of the Great Recession in the 2008 to 2010 timeframe, or they just really get tired of the uh, corporate rat race, uh, whether it be too much travel, too many politics, and things like that. And so many of our owners bring that great experience, management, leadership experience, but want to do something for themselves. And they like the opportunity to, again, be in the B2B space um, and really have a good quality of life. We are very much a Monday through Friday, even eight to five, nine to five type of business, and they really like that life-work balance that maybe they didn't get in the corporate environment. Most of our owners at SpeedPro never did anything with print before, except for maybe being a buyer. Um, we have a number of our owners that were in logistics or in purchasing or maybe in marketing. So maybe they use some of our uh, media, some of our graphics uh, when they were the buyer. But almost nobody in our network, except for maybe three or four, actually had prior printing experience. And so we have built our training program to really take a new owner all the way through how do I go from corporate America from one and run a small business? And so we have two weeks of intensive training in Denver at our headquarters. The first week is what we call our business training. Uh, first of all, they're stuck with me for uh, several hours to do some orientation and understanding the franchise relationship and how we partner together. But we do a deep dive in our point of sale system and how to price, how to understand our pro parts, products, and applications. And then we dig right into the financial management. We have a full day of how do you make money in wide format printing? What are the levers? What are the ratios? Uh, what are magic numbers that if I do X, I'm going to get Y? Then we do two days of sales and marketing training and a whole day on recruiting and retention because we think that's a cornerstone to a successful business. You have to have people in your business. And so how to find the right people, recruit them, train them as well, and then how do you retain them? And then after an owner then starts getting their equipment installed, they have the lease signed, get the equipment installed, and then we bring them back in for a full week of production training, and then we're at their studio to provide follow-up training throughout the first year. I think the future is really bright in our industry. If you look at all of printing, all segments, um, wide format, grand format, which is more like the billboards, offset printing, which is more for the business cards, brochures, and things like that. The industry itself is fairly flat, maybe growing about 1%. But wide format business alone that we specialize in last year and the last two years has grown about 6% year over year. According to marketing surveys, 80% of marketers say they're not only going to spend the same, but maybe even more on printed wide format types of products, and only about that 20% may be unsure, maybe have a decline. So we really feel that this part of our industry, the wide format printing, is going to continue to grow for some time because brands really see the benefit of going from online for brand awareness, but really getting in front of the 
a client when they're maybe walking the mall or even here at the trade show and I need to be impacted to say I want to buy or I want to come talk to somebody right now. I really do think SpeedPro is a great investment. Again, whether you're coming from corporate America, whether you're looking at us as a conversion, maybe you have a small format commercial printer. Uh, we have the systems, the resources, we have an owner group that is exceptionally supportive of each other. None of our owners feel like they compete with each other at all. We have some good separation between owners, but almost every one of our studios has a different type of concentration. One may be very, very heavy in vehicle wraps, another one very heavy on rebranding of corporate spaces. And so we have very little overlap, maybe in the top two or three categories, but we serve up to 30 or more industries, and there's very, very little overlap in that. They also love, again, mostly coming out of corporate America, they love the life-work balance. So that Monday through Friday, eight to five, small number of employees, maybe two to four, they really like that balance. And they also like the entrepreneur model that we have. Every day is different, every project is different. They can really bring a lot of problem solving and creativity to our business where they necessarily can't do that in every business. It's easy to find SpeedPro, whether it be Franchise Direct, uh, franchise, uh, SpeedProFranchising.com, excuse me. Um, a lot of different ways to, to find us. Um, we have an application form. You can request more information and we'd love to be able to start that conversation. We would do what we call a step one call just to make sure what you're looking for, that we're a good fit for your needs. And then we would have you start talking to our franchise sales consultants, our business uh, consultants as well, to make sure that this is the type of business that's a perfect fit for you.